This is Alex from Euclid Machine and Design. It's uh, getting kind of late on a Friday night, trying to get some uh, bronze parts finished up so we don't have to come in over the weekend. Uh, haven't done a whole lot of work with this material. It's silicon bronze. Uh, machine's pretty nice though. Uh, tricky part with this is our part is like 10 feet long. So we've uh, jigged up a way to actually support it with bungees from the ceiling. So uh, this started as a solid square bar. As you can see, it's got a channel going all the way through it now, except for at the very end. So we're on the last setup, running a half inch solid carbide end mill and kind of a jank air and uh, coolant mist setup. So we'll go ahead and uh, get it rolling. Air. Here we're ready to go. Putting off some nice chips. So I've got the first couple cuts done. What we're doing with this is uh, stepping back and forth while going down to uh, make a nice wide slot to get chips out. Um, so we're going to go ahead and show the, this is the third pass for stepping down 100 and also stepping over 100. So here we go, got the slot all roughed out, uh, just got to take another like 10 or 15 on the sides and bottom. Uh, so I'll go ahead and get that running and uh, turn the camera back on when it's about done. So we're just finishing up the final pass on the sidewall. They were running more like 900 RPM. Just taking about four thou. Well, there we are, all done. All ten feet of it. So now we just gotta clean up the floor. We got cardboard around to try to keep this stuff separate. These uh, silk and bronze apparently is pretty expensive. I think these two bars cost around. Uh, $3,000 so we're hoping to get something for the scrap see there's from about 12 inches of uh, cut so overall we've done about maybe 75 pounds of scrap which is uh, pretty impressive because this end mill has done all of that so uh, it's hogged out a lot of material all right well we're gonna clean up and uh, head out <laughs> 